What's up guys, it's Chris and I'm back again with another tutorial. This tutorial was requested by Cineflix for Life and Barkley54. What I'm going to show you is how to do the flicker effect that you've seen in my videos House of Nightmares 2 and 3. So let's go ahead and get started. What you want to do is, here's the hallway that I'm standing in in the House of Nightmares video. As you can see, I'm not anywhere in this picture. You need to record just a little bit before you actually step into the frame so you can save that as a picture and then import it into your video editing software. I've already done that, so let's go ahead and get started. You want to drag your picture on the layer above your video file. Oh, I might want to slice this. As you can see, I'm walking down the hallway there, getting in position. Okay, now we want to make several small slices of different sizes on the image half. This will create the flicker effect. Now we'll go back and delete every other one. Okay, now that's really all you have to do. Let me render this and show you what it'll look like. Alright, now you can watch right up here. See, there I am flickering in and out. That's all you have to do. You have to have the background, go ahead and take a picture, or Record a little bit enough of the empty space before you actually start your video so you can save that as a picture like I did with a hallway right here. Then you want to drag that onto the layer above your video and just make small slices so it'll make it look like you're flickering in and out but you're really not. You're just making a picture appear above your video file. Sorry I kind of rushed on this. My video recording software keeps crashing on me, so hopefully I'll get this done this time because this makes my, like, my fourth time of trying. But anyway, hopefully I explained that good enough, or hopefully you can understand it good enough to make your own version of it. You can post a video response and let me see how you've done, and I'll post my comments on it. And that's all for this tutorial. I have another one coming up, which will probably be done very, very soon. Till then, see you later.